Okay, here we go. I think this one's going to be one of the worst pulls I've done in a long time. Probably going to take the cake. An above ground pool, obviously been neglected for quite a while. We can obviously see in the footage here how much foliage and stuff like that is around the pool. So I started off here by pulling the the pool cleaner out of the pool and just getting my pole and my scoop and just trying to scoop as much of the debris out as possible. Uh, we probably spent a good 45 minutes to an hour here just scooping. I think we ended up filling pretty close to an 80 litre bin just full of leaves. reason I'm doing this is just to try and get the pool clean as possible I guess uh, before we start adding all our chemicals in had to retire this pool pole after this one the weight of all those leaves just screwed the screwed the handle These little pool clarifying crystal cubes do a cracking job. Chuck the seal box, that lasts about three to four weeks. Now we're going to get into it, hit it heavy, going into the leader of pool algae side. Obviously, your job is to kill off the algae. We're going to team that up with a good couple of kilos of pool pouring. I like to use granulator just because it's easier to cart around in the ute. High strength. Just easier than liquid chlorine in my opinion. Once we've gotten the chems in, we'll get back on the pole here and um, use the broom. And broom and stir up as much of the dirt and stuff that's on the bottom of the pool. I'm sure there's heaps of leaves still down there. No doubt. Fingers crossed we can come back tomorrow and have a better idea of what we're in, what we're in for. Be nice to see nice clear water, no leaves, but I doubt it. You can see how much it's changed just in the couple of hours we've been here today. Surprisingly, it doesn't smell too bad. Uh, you can start to see all that sort of dead algae and crap sort of coming up to the surface. 24 hours later. So we're back here now the next day. Pretty surprised with the results to be honest. Uh, by no means clean. Um, but we've gotten rid of the green tinge. Pool's really really murky. And now we hit it with some ultra sheen. Which is kind of like a flock going to help bulk all the particles, organic matter that's sort of making the pool look murky. And fingers crossed it'll drop it all to the bottom so that when we come back we can set up our pool vacuum and vacuum all the stuff to waste. Twenty-four hours later. Here now for day three. A lot better results. Definitely see we missed some leaves. Uh, but at least we've got nice clean water. We can see the bottom again. Uh, so we can now set up the vacuum and get vacuuming. We're going to vacuum all this stuff to waste. I'm probably going to leave the leaves behind. Just concentrate on the, the dirt, the easier stuff. And probably at the end of today get the pool scoop back out again and give it another hit.
in the end, we got pretty lucky with this job. Client's now going to go on a regular program. Hopefully that way we can help keep it under control. It's got a sand filter, got a pump. No chlorinate of those, so we'll get a tablet dispenser out, load that up with some chlorine tablets. Get back here in three or four weeks and see how we're going.